reporting for you live from Port Macquarie here in Jolly Nose, where we're gearing up for the next edition of the Fox Superflow sealed by stands. And once again, we have a full house. It is so awesome. Thank you all of you who are still registering. It is a Thursday afternoon, a very lovely, nice, warm Thursday afternoon where we're setting up the tracks. And we're at the far track. We're at Laser. And this is one of the reasons why so many people come here every year again. And it is because the local club, the Hastings Valley Mountain Bike Club, is so active. There's so many of them racing with us all year long. And when they're not racing with us, surely they are here building stuff like this. That's going to be one of the most talked about features of the weekend. It's the road gap. And guess what? I'm leaving it in. It is a cool feature. We looked at it uh, many different angles. But I think it works. I think it is reasonably forgiving. But if you're doing this run for the first time, I'm on the laser, I'm the far track. Cut, don't come in too hot because if you come in here too hot, it's gonna hurt. But if you look at it as a perfectly good beeline here to the side, this is the one we're using. I'm not using the other one because then uh, there's a potential of riders landing on top of other riders and we don't want any of that. But yeah, gap jump on laser track is open. The other two are, of course, Fox and Stans. I'm assuming they look very similar to last year. I haven't uh, marked them yet, so uh, I will let you know in uh, the comments below and in the details of the rider briefing if there's any significant changes but i don't think so this is the one i believe where most love has been gone into if you're coming as always saturday races a race on saturday sunday races a race on sunday the weather it's uh i think we, it, it's gonna be all right there's a little bit of rain forecast but uh, I don't think it's going to be all that much. And I don't think it's going to hit us much before possibly Saturday night and then Sunday after the race. So fingers crossed that the forecast is accurate. Well, we'll wait and see. But at, uh, at this stage, it's nothing that uh, gets me concerned. It might do get a little bit slippery if you get the odd shower on this stuff. Especially everything that's red and clay or wooden features. If it does even the littlest, littlest of showers, be very, very careful on those things, please. Uh, one of the biggest problems we have here, unfortunately, is, is our phone reception issue. So uh, we, how the way we're going to solve that is you will come to the main car park, with it, which is the finish of the Fox track. You're going to get your number plates there. But uh, then once we've done it in the morning, handing out of all the, the rider plates, if there's any changes or anything like that, you need to come and see us at the orange bus, which is at the finish of stands. So it'll come very clear where everything is, or you can look, look at the map as well. Oh, this guru. Oh, is he gonna take the A line? Oh, ah! the B line. It's easy. We're we're having we're having fun on the Thursday afternoon. Uh, where was that? Yes. So, uh, if any dramas, come and see us at the red. Uh, sorry, the orange bus rather. And that's where we're gonna fix all uh, timing issues that may arise throughout the day, or if there's any changes in categories, stuff like that. We need to do it there because we don't have phone reception at the main car park, so we can't. Uh, we're, we're a little bit limited in what we can do over there. Um, other than the rest, the club has uh, looked after us to get some um, food for us sorted. We have technical support uh, on site as well. And then, yeah, a wonderful Port Macquarie region. A huge thanks for the support that we are getting from the local council. And uh, they're going to be on day to welcome, on day here as well, to welcome us to the region, which is great. I'm gonna keep it short because you've seen those uh, many times before. Most of you have. If you haven't, if you're new to this, just come and chat through us on the day. Uh, you, we start at nine. Last run is at 3:30 on both days, so that's where you need to be at the start. Five runs per track. Fastest one counts, and it's gonna be some really, really fast ones, especially when they're fun like this. Whoop! Let's go put some more bunting out and have some more fun on those trails. I see you Saturday morning. Whoop whoop.